Hey you guys, what's going on? So, looks like this week I have a 2017 Mazda 6 Grand Touring. This one has the premium package, so this is gonna be loaded up with all of the Napa leather, everything like that. Now, if you guys do follow my channel, I have already done a review on this exact car. So if you guys want, be sure to go back in my videos, check that out. Um, I also did a nighttime view on this car. So when I got this as my press car this week, um, I was trying to figure out what to do because I basically covered this car in its entirety and I haven't done a drive video yet so I'm just gonna hit you guys with a drive video um, kind of go all out so I'm definitely gonna take this on some good back roads show you guys how it handles because in my opinion this is one of the best handling mainstream sedans on the market now I haven't driven like the new 2018 Toyota Camry yet so I can't really speak for it but everything else is a definite yes. Um, if you guys aren't familiar, just to refresh your memory, this does have a six speed torque converted automatic. You have paddle shifters up here, sport mode, normal mode, and we're on this back dirt road right now. So super excited to take this out for a drive for you guys. Also be sure to subscribe, stay tuned because at the end of the month I have a RF Miata coming in that I'm finally gonna get to drive. So I do get an RF Miata for a week. Super pumped for that. So without further ado guys, let's go ahead and take it for a drive. Let's go manual mode. All right, here we go. Turn in on here is incredible. Watch this. Transmission's great on here too. I mean, the shifts are super quick. I mean, it's definitely one of the quickest for being just a traditional automatic. So like downshift in a second. I don't know if you can see the gauge, but upshift. And it does rev match downshifts for you, which is pretty cool. And now, just like the Miata, which of course this company builds, but I mean, this sedan definitely has that same kind of personality as the Miata. And by that, what I mean is you can rev this motor out. I mean, you can rev it all the way to its 6,000 RPM red line and it doesn't feel like you're gonna break the car, break the motor. So I think that's one of the best things about this car. You can just give it full gas, full throttle, and you're not really breaking speed limits. I mean, I'm cruising at like 60 miles an hour right now, and it's in, a, it's in its sport mode right now, so the, right now it's in its most aggressive setting, if you will. So the throttle response is pretty much instantaneous. So right now, 60 miles an hour, 3,000 RPM, and if I just go all the way foot to the floor, it'll automatically automatically downshift like two or three gears. So like for example, foot to the floor right now. And it's just super immediate. Like it's, it's pretty ridiculous. So even though it does have 184 horsepower, this transmission really just rings every single ounce of that horsepower out so that you don't really feel like there's a lack of power. I mean, of course, there is that want for more of that kind of torque shove in your seat that you don't get. But as far as everyday driving, I mean, this motor is more than adequate to handle 
anything you throw at it. Now here's another thing that I thought was incredible. So I live out here, Benbrook, Fort Worth, Texas, and at night, or even during the day sometimes, there's like stray cats, um, possums, I've seen armadillos walk through the roads, deer, and just all kinds of obstacles. And there have been multiple times when I've had to like try to dodge something or if someone like has a blowout chunks of tire whatever you may have it but the fact that this car has such good agility and has such good stance making those emergency maneuvers are just super confidence inspiring in here so I mean I'm going 70 miles an hour right now so I'm going 70 miles an hour and if I had to dodge something make a quick left and a quick right I mean the composure is just so good and like I probably wouldn't do that in any other car. Alright you guys, I'll turn this back road. These are probably some of the best winding roads around. Now if you live in an area that's got windy roads like this, the Mazda 6 is going to absolutely run away from everything else in the class. on these roads guys good gosh really hope y'all enjoyed that enjoyed that drive video because I know I sure did all right well guys thank y'all so much for watching um, I mean if you guys want to subscribe to my channel please click up here to the left guys um, I've got a lot more cool content like this on its way and if you guys want to see some of my other videos be sure to click up here to the right thank you so much for watching you guys bye